Hello, hello. Hi, Lidor, and hello, British. So let's get this party going then. Okie dokie. Um, what is new in heart testing? I mean, there's a lot of new things, Lidor. It's probably best if you can uh, read it, actually. You can go on the Discord server and everything is there, basically. But one thing, for example, there's this offline skin creator, so you can uh, play around and create your perfect skin without having to join any server. But there is a lot of uh, new things as well. Wait, what? 16 people. Oh my god. <laughs> well, this will take a while. And for some reason we have a, a Herrera. <laughs> I think this is from the old port testing. Well, we will have to get rid of the Herrera, that's for sure. Hey, 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 Elvis. Welcome, welcome. How are you guys doing, by the way? Did you have a nice weekend? Was everything alright? <clears throat> yeah, I know, Lidor. But I was, like, sick. <laughs> I managed to get a nasty cold and I was out. Couldn't do anything. I mean, even now, I'm still uh, recovering, but yeah. at least it's more manageable. <clears throat> yeah, now I can... Now I can fight it properly. Oh, British has a new channel. Nice. By the way, um, any of you played on the hard testing branch yet? Because I did a short test earlier, I uh, joined the NA server and the FPS was like bad, <laughs> for me at least. It was somewhere between 35 FPS and uh, maybe 50, let's say, ish, 55. So I don't know, hopefully that's only for the whole testing branch and um, maybe we don't have the proper settings or I don't know.
Hmm. Well, that's a good point, Lidor. Hmm. Yeah, it really might be worth uh, checking the private servers. And to be honest, when the Rex and Trike drop, you can imagine the private servers uh, will be overflown, overcrowded. Because that that would be those would be basically the only places where you can actually f find those creatures, those dinosaurs. Because if I remember correctly, they won't be on officials. That's for sure. Also, on this new horde testing branch with some new updates, apparently they removed the the dam at northeast, so that that should be interesting. And also, there's like a cave in the volcano at the northeast. So if you go up the mountain there, then yeah. And I'm really curious, like, whatever this Herrera is, probably he's at the East Plains, I will get rid of it, uh, sp then spawn as a Dilo, and I'll just go explore those two new spots at Northeast. Well, this is gonna take a while, it seems. I would have joined sooner, but earlier when I tried to join, there wasn't such a, a big queue. Anywho, probably in 5 minutes-ish, we should be able to get in. <laughs> Elvis, I think, uh, thank you, but I think uh, we're only the four of us here. It's Lidor, you, British, and me. <laughs> four now, at least. Okay, speaking of 4, that's our position in queue. I mean, we're almost in. <laughs> well, thank you for that. And all of you can always join if you feel like it, but you probably knew that already. Judging from the from some videos that I watched and some pictures, I think Harry sent me a, a picture as well regarding the northeast changes there at the dam. I mean, it should be pretty interesting. It won't be such a safe haven for Pekis and Omnis there. 
At least in theory. Well, hopefully we're still going strong for our position in queue. Fingers crossed, but... Hmm. Ah, there we go. Wonderful. I was afraid uh, it got like blocked or something. We have we have a wild Terran in the chat. Hello, hello, Terran. How are you doing? Yes, we're connecting. Finally. Let's see. Let's see the new changes. I mean, I'm especially interested in the changes at northeast at the. Yeah, at northeast. Hopefully we will see those and I don't know what else. Ah, oh, perfect. So I don't have any dinosaur here. Dilophosaurus. There we go. And I think we picked something like this one for today. Although this one looks kind of... He looks like a candy, to be honest. I'll just go with the green one. Ho ho! It's your day off. That's wonderful. So should we spawn at... You know what? Let's just spawn at this place as usual. See if we can get some proper diet. And this is what I'm saying regarding the FPS. I usually had like 60 but now oh also uh, there's a new thing you notice how the the plants are like a bit invisible the the plants nearest to you so this is another modification another addition basically so that you can see your tiny dinosaur better but there's like probably a lot of new thing is let's see I mean the FPS will not be great it is what it is but we'll try to to manage so I heard the goat right For sure I heard the goat. Where's the goat? I see it. I see the goat. Oh no. No, not that way. Dude, I can't see anything. Is it gonna finally die today? That would be optimal, right? There we go. Hey, welcome Harry. How are ya? 
Yeah, exactly, Tyron. <laughs> Goat simulator. Wait, what? I ate all of it? No. I wish I knew the proper settings for the for the FPS to go back to like 60 where it was for me or where it actually is on the officials but probably we'll have to fiddle with the settings a bit more anywho let's sniff around what else do we have here Should we go with plus 30%? I mean plus 50%? Hmm. We would need a deer, a hipsy, or a carno. Or a chicken. Interesting. Let's just brisk it. I mean we don't have a lot to lose at the moment. We're too small anyways. There's some dead things here. Maybe we we get lucky and we can get a corpse. No, this is a Pero and some other Peros. Okay. Yeah, chickens are uh, really rare. And I also saw some rabbits, but those are even more rarer. Believe it or not, I saw some rabbits at uh, Highlands. Ooh, what do we have here? This is a... Oh, it's definitely something. Oof. That's a big setup. That's a serato? Okay. Let's see if it still has the organs. Although I, I highly doubt it, but yeah, you never know. Yeah, no organs. Hmm, I think I need a better PC to be honest. I'm sure the game would look even more amazing with at least 60 FPS. I mean stable FPS. It is what it is though, at the moment. So many dead stuff around here. Hmm. That's a small Herrera. Oh, actually, if that's a small Herrera, but it's too small, right? I don't think the organs will... I don't need this. Well... This is weird. I cannot move. <laughs> Hello, game, please. Though I can crouch. I cannot attack. Oh my god. I can't do anything, like I can't move. 
Is this like a new bug or an old bug? Whatever bug. Quickly, quick, quick. Maybe just maybe we get back in pretty soon. Would be awesome if uh, it didn't put me in a big queue again. Then again, I couldn't do anything about that. Anything? Any response? Connecting? Not connecting? Something? <laughs> Actually, Harry, I think I read that as well in the um, Discord. Uh, so basically, what I understood from it is a full adult uh, Dino will be able to to actually drown a big stego, a full adult stego, if uh, the stego is swimming. Or the 75% thing still applies and the stego would need to be below 6.5 uh, tons. Come on, game. Oh, wow. This is unexpected. <laughs> the question is, will it connect though? Hmm, apparently. Yes. Interesting. Oh, I think it was a server crash or something. Let's check. If we can't find any food around, then yeah. Was most likely server crash. Actually, you know what? Let's bounce from here. Mm. I'm not that interested in getting a perfect diet, to be honest. Maybe we can uh, chase a deer, or maybe we can find a deer somewhere there, at northeast. Okay, so that's a big Sarah across the pond. And we would need to go, basically, to him. Seems like there is a lot of activity around here. That's a boar, no thank you. Let's say we did, but we didn't. going the right direction not sure probably I 
think I heard the uh, a Pecky as well. Oh, this is the, the way. Okay. Oh, wow, the lighting. I mean, it really looks better. That's for sure. Just like a, a quick impression of it. I can only imagine how it would look with uh, a powerful PC that can run everything at a, at least uh, 60 FPS. Hmm. Interesting. I think I'll have to wait until next year for that to happen. And maybe from the news that I seen lately, it seems like a new architecture will be available for both AMD and for NVIDIA as well. So yeah, who knows? New CPUs, new uh, graphics cards. Maybe there are some really nice things. But probably th if those appear, they should appear somewhere in autumn-ish. Maybe September, October, something like that. Oh, there's definitely a Pecky at North... <laughs> At northeast. I can't say that I like, um, I'm gonna play it in a serious mode today. I I honestly want to see the new places, what they've done with the dam part, and the new cave. And that should be my main... Hmm, nice flowers. And there's like adult carnos as well. I haven't seen Northeast yet, uh, Harry. I've seen the the screenshot that you sent me, and I mean I haven't seen seen it in game. I think I saw some of it from uh, some videos. I'm just looking at those trees, for example, and they really look different, like the green on them, the their leaves. Is this like only because of the the lightning? Or the lighting? Because it looks awesome. Hmm. You think so, Harry? I guess we'll see. Wait, the, I don't remember, like, this is, this is extended, right? This wall, it shouldn't be this long. Or, maybe I'm mistaken? Nah, this, this wasn't here, definitely. And that vegetation to our, to our right. Oh yeah, this is changed. I think I should have played as a Ptera instead of a Dillo. I could have had a, a more aerial representation of everything. Hmm. Ok, 
Okay. Those are two Sarahs on the other side. They're just chilling. I'm not interested in them. Wow, this feels a lot more... Uh... Oh, and those are the Carnos. <laughs> I think the Carnos saw the Sarahs. Oh, let's see. Let's see what happens. We got front row seats, apparently. Do you think the Carnos will try it? I mean, they definitely will try it. Oh, yeah. Oh, the Sarahs are down. I think this is it. Can they like get somewhere here or not? Oh, noobs. They could. <laughs> And that's an Omni. Too many things, okay. Let's bounce. Okay, the... The Carnos crossed. Doom, 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 doom. I just love the Carno. How he sounds when he is running. I mean, let's follow, we don't have anything else to do. Okay, they're definitely fighting. Since when there's like three Sarahs. So there's two Carnos there. And <laughs> three little Sarahs. Oof. Oh. They're fighting alright. Whoops. Grab some popcorn. I think one of the Sarahs is down, or? There were like three Sarahs. Nobody sees me. I'm invisible. He saw me. Ah, he was friendly. Nice. I think they're they're gonna go the other side for the Sarahs, right? That would be the logical thing to do. Uh, 
and the Seras are back on the rock. <laughs> Interesting. Everything seems more green, that's for sure, with this lighting. I'm just uh, I'm just eyeballing those Seras. They're on the rock there. And any time now, the Carnos should come from the other side, right? Thirty-six percent. Maybe we should mind our own business, though. please <laughs> I'm uh, I'm gonna go away I'll leave them be they can get back their stem and go for the Seras I would need to find some food actually Didn't we had here the bullfrog for this that I don't know I don't I can't remember oh my god they extended the the fences a lot I mean the gates and everything there wow this is new and this place this whole area is new yeah, it definitely should have been up there. What do I hear here? Do we have some water or what? Yeah, there's definitely something. Yeah, no problem, Harry. Okay. Oh, I will definitely have a look at this place some other time. Just Papa Terra and explore everything from above. Because now as a Dilo, it seems a bit uh, overwhelming, like there's so many new spots here at Northeast. And I can bet you there is a lot of new stuff uh, also on the map, not only at Northeast. But maybe people didn't discover them or who knows. This is one thick forest here. <laughs> nice. I really like it. I only wish the the FPS was a bit higher though. I mean at 45 FPS it's still playable, but 60 would definitely not hurt. Let's see. 
so basically at 5 p.m. it already started to go dark with the um, with the previous update. I'm curious now. So this is without night vision. Yeah, but it's a bit cloudy as well, so that makes sense. Nice, Darren. There's so many new stuff at Northeast. I can't even uh, cover it all, to be honest. I would need to be up there instead of a Dillo. Interesting. Okay, so this is the place where we... Oh, actually, now we have 90% view to our left viewing angles to the left and right hand side when you're drinking or eating. So that's... That's something new again. So yeah, Terran, like I said, there's so many new stuff at Northeast. It's it's amazing. I mean, yeah, you know the general way. You won't get lost, but then again, there's a lot of new stuff. And I haven't even been to the cave yet, to the volcano cave. Mm -mm -mm. Maybe we should leave that for daylight. That should be better. Okay, but this is amazing. So it's 5 p.m. in game and still there's so much light. I wonder how this will actually, how long will it go on? Because this is like a, a much needed change. Or this was a much needed change. Hello Christian, welcome, welcome. I'm good, thank you. How about you? Do you still have that uh, Dino on your 6? Because I lost mine on uh, probably, I think, the last stream or something like that. Also, no AIs, even though we're in like the migration zone. Interesting. Mm -mm 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 -mm. But I tell you, uh, Northeast really feels different now. I mean, look at that big wall. It And it's probably extended all the way down there. To be honest, I can't wait to be up there and just explore this place till the last drop. <laughs> Oh, that's perfect. May your Dino live long and prosper. <laughs> and let's have a look at the dam. I mean, at the place where the dam was. Oh, wow. <laughs> There's nothing here. Nothing, nothing. I mean, there is something, but... Mm 
Well, bye bye. <laughs> bye bye for Omnis and for Pekis. Actually, not really. I think this is. Let me have a look at this. Oh yeah, this is basically the new, the new Pecky and Omni rock. You can't get here as uh, another dinosaur. Okay, that was random. The question is, did it crash or? Yes, this terrain, it, it really looks amazing, Terran. I, I really like it. And I've discovered what, like, maybe 30% of it. Okay, maybe more, but definitely not entirely. Okay, it seems the server took a little break. <laughs> Wait, Lidor. Oh, you're banned from the Isle Discord. Well, you've been up to no good. Mm, let me see. I'm just gonna copy and paste everything. Oh, actually, I can't. <laughs> Interesting. The text is basically too long. There's like really a lot of stuff. I'm going to see how much I can paste and how much I can't. What if I take like some four? Mm. Let's see how this looks. Okay, so maybe I need to copy only three ah, this doesn't look good it doesn't uh, put them one beneath each other for some reason mm. Let me try it like this then. Nah, it doesn't work. Is the server up? What do you mean 90 minutes cooldown? Did I miss something? Um, where did you see that, Harry? I mean, it's definitely not up, but where did you... I'm gonna check... Uh, the discussions as well. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Felipe said he he will restart it. Oh, now I understand what you said, Harry. You were referring to the unstuck command. Okay. Yes, Darren. Diablo apparently will come in May. So, we have like only one month to go which is amazing and then the dibble will be definitely played by everybody <laughs> also when I get uh, I want to go for a for a very short break uh, maybe some minutes but have has anyone seen I mean you probably seen the the last uh, video right from the um, what was it called some trail cam some something something and at the end that when they showcased the, the dibble uh, at the end there was like a, a big carnivore and I really am curious what that one is because it really it, it makes you think with the heavy stumps that it's a t-rex but then who knows, maybe it's an Allosaurus or yeah. Hello Blueberry, welcome to the uh, to the stream. The uh, horde testing is basically another branch of the game where you can just test stuff that is new. That's the whole functionality behind it. Do you really think it's an Alberto, Terran? I would so hope that it's actually an Allosaurus because I really like the Allo. And welcome Flash as well. Yeah, we'll get Dibble for sure in May. At least that's what the... Um, that's what the dev said on the Discord if I remember correctly. D-Rex will not be on officials, Lidor, and Trike will not be as well in officials. They're too big probably for the devs vision. But you can find them on... Uh, you will probably be able to find them for sure on the private servers and private servers at that at that point will just flourish <laughs> so Taron you say Diablo and Alberto okay okay well we know for sure Diablo's gonna be in but who knows so the the surprise will who knows I'm really curious as well. <laughs> yeah, I like I like it as well. So far I played like what 50 minutes, uh, Gordon. But the thing is my FPS is not what it's currently on the official servers. Uh, mine's on like 45-ish FPS, maybe up to 50. So it took a bit of a hit on my side at least. But be right back everyone, so in some minutes.
Okie dokie, back. Oh wow. You wrote a lot. Let's see. Hmm. Hello Mishakon. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Okay, the server seems to be up. So Harry made the point that that carnivore was scavenging. Which is a fairly good point. That was my impression as well. Although, if that is what the devs are trying to make you think it is, then maybe it's not, you know? So, mm, we'll see. But what I really enjoyed is the pinning mechanic. Like, that Diablo went down pretty fast with two Omnis on its back. Like, honestly, it, it, really, it really vanished a bit. And then when the third one came as well, yeah, it was bye-bye. <laughs> I reset my graphics settings. Gordon, yeah. Hello, Elfo. Welcome to the stream. There's like a lot of new things. If you can, I would suggest uh, reading them on the Discord channel, on the game's Discord channel. Because just there's like really a lot. So when you when you say reset your graphics settings, uh, do you mean like um, deleting that folder entirely, Gordon? That um, hmm. And if so, which folder? I think I remember there was a folder called in the app data, the aisle, and then something. Oh, and thank you if you subbed, Elfo. Thank you very much. Well, I did that. This is this is what I have at the moment. So the limit is set to 60. This is whatever. Well, you know what? Out of curiosity, Oh, well, it didn't do anything. Interesting. So what if... Actually, now you made me curious. I think I had my... Um, that folder that I spoke about maybe I had it on read only I'm gonna check so we go to local the aisle saved config windows or windows client actually mm. yeah it's on okay Let's see if now it if it works. Reset. Restart. Wait, what? Okay, this is not the uh, enjoyable. <laughs> 
everything became so crisp like too crisp i'm gonna do it like this then i'm gonna manually i know the screen turned black for a bit but out of curiosity let's see so play again maybe the queue will not be that big when you, when we get back so Darren you say that the hmm But I did this already. Weird. Didn't I press on reset? Um, you know what? I'm gonna just try to join to see if it made the difference or not. Oh my god. Now with, there's 13 people in the queue maybe um okay we, we will definitely wait this queue uh, but after that i think i will not fiddle anymore with the settings because this takes away from the gameplay so i will when the stream ends i will have a look at the settings and see if i can improve it somehow Okay, your friend said to turn off Lumen. Controls the level of visual effects in the game with higher setting, yielding better, blah blah blah, okay. Global, ah no, global illumination. Anywho. And now there's 17. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, Terran. They'll probably uh, see a screen filled with nothing for the past for the next 15 to 20 minutes if we get lucky. But on the plus side though, um, people are playing the horde testing branch which is uh, helping the devs so that's perfect mm -hmm. i'll probably will not harry But can you imagine, like, when the Dibble drops? What should you play uh, the first time? Because, okay, you know the Dilo has sparring and has new sounds, new mechanics, new everything. But then again, what if it actually drops with that secret uh, carnivore? I mean, together with that secret carnivore. Would you rather play that secret carnivore because it's probably a beast or amazing or... Or would you go for the Dibble? Decisions, decisions. <laughs> I think probably... Uh, the servers will be like half dibbles and half oh no 33% dibbles 33% the new carnivore and the other 33% will actually 
try to kill one of those new thingies just to say that they did. <laughs> Something along those lines, I think. But the thing is, so until now, uh, we didn't had like, um, what is that mechanic called when those uh, like two, three omnis, pay, ah, pinned, okay, so we didn't had the pinned mechanic until now, but I think it will be like, it will be become of OP if two omnis can pin down a debo. It's pretty much game over for the Dibble, right? Even if, let's say, it resists and the Omnis uh, deplete their stamina fast and then the Dibble somehow manages to get up. Can you imagine the bleed that uh, the Dibble will actually have to fight with? Now, this is the, the pin mechanic will definitely be an interesting one and it will open up the possibilities i think at some point we even saw like a rex being pinned down and the trike as well which is pretty amazing like you i can't say anything about that to be honest if a rex and the trike can be pinned down then Players, players who who think uh, they are untouchable will have like a revelation. <laughs> you think the devil will resist to bleed pretty good, Gordon? I mean, it could be. If it goes uh, toe to toe with the Omni, okay, Harry. It is what it is. Whatever FPS we get now, we're gonna play with it until the stream ends, because otherwise, the stream will be comprised of just us uh, being here talking talking about everything but actually not playing anything so <laughs> it would uh, not be the purpose of this stream hey Eman welcome welcome I can't wait to be honest I can't wait to see like an army of billows just take over northeast or east plains like everybody's chill and they're having a good day and then 10 dibbles show up <laughs> that should be interesting should be like a stampede a rampage yeah Terran definitely uh, dibbles should Dibble should be pretty powerful. In my opinion, it should go head on and win against an Omni and maybe even against a, a Dillo. Because Dibbles will weigh a good amount over a ton, right? Maybe two tons, three tons, who knows? And they're like beefy. So yeah, they're and they're speedy as well. Maybe actually the their weakness will be the pinned mechanic. Cause if two omnis can pin a table down, and not to mention if there's like three omnis, because the third one can just bite the devil's head, and that's that's it. Hmm. Interesting, yeah. But can you imagine like a Rex being pinned down or a trike? Who will who will pin down a Rex? 
Does it have to be like five Omnis or what's the deal here? I because I can't see uh, I can't see Dillos being able to pin down a Rex. Probably only Omnis, right? If they're being like little pests. Hmm. Yeah, Terran. Definitely. Oh, come on. Really? 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 Disconnected from Q? And that's why? Oh my god. We, we are not lucky. <laughs> I should have stayed in game when I had the chance. We just received, like, disconnected from Q a message in red oh it doesn't comfort me that i received the message <laughs> disconnected from q because why <laughs> oh my god it is what it is though so far i think uh, the stream had half of gameplay and half of uh talking looking at the main menu What can you do? Well, with the exception that the next uh, big carn carnivore, the secret one, is an Elo, a Gordon. Because otherwise. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 20 Trudon spinning down a Rex. I mean, it, they shouldn't be able to pin him down even 20 because how much does a true don weigh it's probably like a cat or a bigger cat actually no probably like a bigger dog but anywho i don't think they should be able to pin down a big rex oh my god what is this sorcery Yeah, I don't know what's happening. Like, I honestly do not know. I'm gonna check the game's Discord out of curiosity. Oh, somebody said EU2 horde testing crashed again. <laughs> oh, man. Well, this is not such bad news. Because if I keep refreshing... maybe just maybe um i'm trying to play on the hard testing branch m1 yeah so like rooster sized terran then yeah they should shouldn't be able to pin down a rex Well, if they give uh, ambush to like an elo, they should give ambush to a rex as well, because that's like a big, big powerhouse, has a lot of muscles. But then, I don't think they will though. Okay, we are in the game. Does it look a bit better or not? 58, 46, 40, I think it's the same, to be honest. Oh, and we're dying. Well, I definitely need some food. <laughs> Like, it seems a bit better, but just like a tad bit better, without that, uh, 
without the lumen. So apply. Also, oh, everything's on epic. Hmm. What if I put this to far? And materials, I don't know what this is. No, I do not want to restart. Okay, you can remain on epic. Effects. Maybe you can go on high. No. Hmm. Unbelievable. I just hit apply. I didn't do anything else. And it closed down my game. And now it's relaunching it by itself. Oh my god. Well, this is like a stream to remember. <laughs> it's like all of us are suffering together. Come on, quick, 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 quick. Let me in. Yeah, of course. At least we know one thing, and that is that we are dying. <laughs> We don't have any food, but I'm pretty sure we'll find something there. Hmm. <laughs> that that is a bit broken, right, Terran? Like I haven't, uh, I haven't made, I haven't applied the, the settings that would cause the game to have a restart, right? I left them back at their original values, and still, <laughs> it threw me back out of the game. That's that's funny. It is what it is, though. We shall suffer. If that is what we need to do in order to play. Throw all the pain at me. But I will play one way or the other. Also I'm patient with these kinds of things. Well up to a point. But yeah. Okay. 15 people. Exactly, Terran. He said, oh, you want to play so badly, you want to test your uh, graphic settings so badly. Why? Do you want to have 60 FPS by chance? Hmm. Who does have 60 FPS nowadays? Nobody. Go back to the desktop. Also, for everyone that watches the stream, because I notice we're like 15 people, simply thank you for being here. Like, I'm really happy. That we are sharing the same goal and that is playing this wonderful game. But I'm really curious, like, I have so many questions right now. Uh, okay, regarding the new dinosaurs, we can talk until tomorrow about them. But what if there's, like, new areas waiting for for us to discover them? Because they said uh, only the northeast was changed. But who knows? Maybe some other zones were changed as well. And also, will we be able to pin down a stego? as omnis and how many omnis do we need to to pin down a, a big grown stag yeah MV mvps for sure mvps Eight 
people left. No, Harry, do not jinx it. No. At the moment you're gonna jinx it. I think I think this will go pretty smoothly now, Harry. And guess what? When I will go in game, I will not touch the graphic settings. You can only imagine, right? I, I won't even press escape. I will not be interested in those kind of things anymore. And I'll probably have a, a lot of fun testing it uh, off stream. I would rather have like the Rex being released, but that's just me. I would also be very, very happy with uh, an Allosaurus. I think I like Allo more than I like uh, Albertosaurus because Alberto somehow reminds me of a Rex of or a smaller Rex or whatever. So then, if an, if it's actually an Alberto and not a, an Elo or a T-Rex, then when the actual T-Rex will come, it will be like, mm, meh, okay. So, I really wish it, it's either the T-Rex or an Elo. That would be perfect. But uh, regarding your actual question, Harry, Chicken breasts or chicken legs? Probably both. That's that's my answer. Three people and we're in. Also, if it's a if it's an Allosaurus, can you imagine how nice? Will it actually sound and play the vibe you get from it and everything, the speed, the the claws, the everything. Because I, I just love it how it is on Legacy, to be honest. I I played Elo like really a lot when I played Legacy back some years ago. And that powerful neck that he has and that uh, predator posture I mean that dinosaur is perfect it has good stamp it has good bleed it's powerful I mean mm. I would see a pack of Allosauruses be able to take down a Rex I really do hope as well, M1. And that scream is so iconic. But yeah, of course, I would be also extremely happy with the T-Rex. But it's a bit weird though. Those big stomps, right? Weren't they like too heavy for an Elo or for an Alberto because they from the trailer I mean it they sounded not from the trailer from the video they sounded like a bit a bit on the way heavier side they weren't like heavy as a Carno you know Th th that was like a, a different kind of uh, weight added to them Okay, and we're almost dead apparently. Oh, 
Well, at least that Karno can have my body if I die. There seems to be some blood there. Let's check it out. What's this? Oh, we're not gonna die. That Karno is chasing something. Okay, I ran at the exact perfect time. The Karno is at the... Oh, those are the two Karnos from... Way before. Okay. Oh, he saw me. Pretty sure he saw me. Quick, quick, quick. There's like a small Omni somewhere. I think the Omni is on the other side. Yeah, I see him. But that's like two Omnis there. Man, I just need some food. And that Karno is still there. So let's be all sneaky and uh, hope that they don't eat everything. they left well there's only one way to find out and that's for sure There he is. Let's probably not stick around here. I don't think that Karno will forgive us the second time. Actually, we should find some goats here, right? That was a Sarah, but yeah, in that direction there's uh, also that Cardinal. Hmm, this looks interesting. I can't figure out if the night lighting is changed as well. Maybe it's the same. Anywho. So what's the time? It's only... I mean it's almost midnight. When there's gonna be in the morning, uh, we're gonna go and explore that cave here at the volcano. 
but until then maybe let's find the goat let's find something else to eat there should have been some goats around here not to mention there's like the migration zone <laughs> that was an omni for calling i guess he met the carnal oh blue suko welcome to the stream the the past the streams and the past videos were all with voice Oh wow, this is loud. That waterfall is definitely loud. But yeah, uh, blue, welcome to the stream nevertheless. How was your day going and have you had the chance to play the um, the horde testing branch? Do you have any opinions on it? What do you like, what you don't like? Welcome back Lidor. Where's all the AIs? Oh wow, we're 56% <laughs> and we have such a bad diet. Uh, Lidor, I, if I remember correctly, there should be... Juvie AI is now around. Okay, what's that? Is this like only the wind or... With some light raining as well? The audio is... Seems a bit weird to be honest. And also, yeah, good point, Gordon. Um, also, apparently, you can apply Venom to AIs now as well as a Dillo. I think they have a good team, Lidor. It's just that the complexity of the things that they want to do, I mean, the mechanics and everything, 
I don't think it's that simple. Wait, is that like a... I don't know. Yeah. I'm gonna fork all and see if I can do something about it. If not, I'm gonna go for it. He seems pretty on point. Well, he's chasing me pretty decently. It seems like we both have stamina. I got him as well. And that's me. Wonderful. <laughs> I guess uh, that was it. Hmm. Should I go for another Dilo or not? You know what? I said that uh, I wanted to check out the environment as a Terra. <laughs> it is what it is, Gordon. Don't uh, don't worry. I actually die a lot in this game. <laughs> to be honest, I, I was... I was really uh, into the explore mode today. I didn't want to go uh, into sweat mode. And I'm really curious how everything looks from above. Like I can play, I can raise whatever amount of delos, but knowing your environment is definitely way more important. Terra has bad stem. In the horde test, Gordon. Well, it had bad stem. It's nothing new, basically. It had bad stem before as well. Okie dokie. Let's get something to eat. And then we can go to Northeast. Seems like I have a bit more FPS here. Not like a lot, but a bit more. Okay, what do we have here? You've seen turtles, Gordon? That's amazing. Oh nice, there's another Terra.
Gordon, you're saying uh, that you have a full grown Terra and Carno on the heart testing branches. Well, congrats to you, Gordon. So we have a bit of food. Wait, what? So I, I was pretty certain they added something else as well. Ropedi here on stream chat says I mean not on stream chat on regular chat So there's like new trees at highlands and the swamps as well yeah this is definitely this should have been a, a better stream instead of a delo but yeah it can it can be a terra stream nevertheless yeah i saw they took the the goat from the from the delo which is weird but anywho Also, um, Terra is a bit more speedy. I mean, look at the speed that I'm going and I'm... Yeah, Terra is definitely way speedier. Maybe I'm missing something, but check that speed and I'm not doing anything. I can't see much, but shortly the morning should be here and from here I think we can check the highlands and then we'll see after that. They definitely improved something with Terra. Maybe it's not only the speed, yeah, the, the turn radius. Terra didn't do Blidor. Maybe I'm forgetting something, Blidor. Wait, what? What is this morning? Look at these colors. I haven't seen a, a morning like this before. For a brief moment it was like a golden sky. Mm. Interesting. I like it. Anything new, I like it. Okay, so now we can actually see a bit. Maybe we can grab... What do we need for the last diet? Pterodactylus, BP and the sea turtle. Huh. What if we catch a fish? 
Is this a fish? This is not a fish. What if we catch a fish, plant it on the ground, and wait for those little pterodactylus to come by? And then we can kill those. I mean, in theory. Or we can just try to grab some fishes and... Yeah. Haven't seen any fish though. Oh, this is some dead whatever here. I don't know what it is. I don't care. Because I can't grab it. <laughs> uh, I think they increased the timers for the pterodactylus to spawn Gordon. So probably they are there, but it takes more time for them to actually spawn on you. Because they were really a pain. Well, if I can't find any fishes, this is like another terra. Oh, it's oh, it's actually hairy. Yeah, so I'm, I'm thinking maybe I can go to Highlands and check those new trees that um, Rob Eddie was talking about. So let's see. Okay, this is without the night vision, and this is with night vision. Yeah, exactly. That's interesting, uh, Lidor. I actually really liked to pack everything as a Terra back on uh, the old map. And sometimes I could I could pack uh, the other dinosaurs more than decently. Oh yeah, these are definitely new trees here. These big ones. Okay, so this whole, yeah, everything is new. Hmm. Let's see if we can actually 
stay and rest around here. Yeah, this seems like a decent place. So yeah, all these trees on the left hand side, the big ones, they are definitely new here. And on the right side, yeah, this, this feels a bit different, even only with these modifications. And who knows what other modifications there might be. But suddenly, this place became amazing for Herrera as well. You know? In each of these tall trees, there may be a Herrera. And if you don't look up, you could have like a nasty surprise. Yeah, exactly, Lidor and Gordon. Hmm, interesting modifications though. I wonder if there is anything at the... Um, at the canyon. Oh my god, this stamina takes so long. I forgot. <laughs> okay, so this is new. Before you could see the skin code here and now it's click to show and copy. Interesting. Okay. Well you're not far heavy. Yeah, definitely Tavern. These are some awesome changes. I really like it. Or like them. And I haven't discovered everything yet. So I'm pretty sure there's like hidden changes that maybe nobody saw until now. But this is like Herrera land for sure. Well, I think we can do it like that, Gordon. So from here we can go to uh, south and check if there's some modifications there. And if not, then we'll go to the swamp. Let's see if we can f find maybe a fish or two. Oh wow, you can actually see the raindrops now. But like really see them. Yeah, this is... This is wonderful. I love it. Look at that. Awesome. This really feels like a a hot stormy day in the middle of summer. The only thing is we we kinda need some fishes. Are they like removed or something? Can't find any fish.
Okay, so there's some dead things there. Interesting. this I don't know what this is but it's big <laughs> okay interesting you know what We'll try to go, f if that's a goat, we're trying to go for it. Yeah, it's a goat. Well, little by little. <laughs> All three of us are trying to catch it. I mean, I'm pretty sure we will succeed in the end. How many shots does it require though? I mean, I know we are small. I missed there. There we go. Food. I think we should fill our bellies maybe till half of, or something like this. Yeah, this should be decent. Alrighty then. Let's see what the next step should be. Mm, maybe get back some stem and then continue our way uh, going south. And then from south, going to Swamp. 
sounds pretty reasonable I think and we still haven't visited the the cave at northeast but I'll, I'll save that for as the last thing oh wow this this feels this gives you the vibes like you really feel there's like a, a very big rain going on it it pours wonderful Oh, and I'm almost out of water. I didn't realize this. Yeah, Terran. Definitely. I can't wait, to be honest, to get a new PC and experience everything in true 4K. But I'll still have to wait maybe more than half a year or something. But that day will come at some point. And that would be a, an amazing day. Yeah, Taiwan. So for some reason, this lighting they they did the touches are definitely for the better. Like honestly, be before and especially uh, during the evening and probably, I mean during the mornings as well. Yeah, could be Terran. I haven't paid much attention to that, but you're probably right now that I think of it. Oh, and there's... <laughs> there's silence here. Wonderful. And now, back to not hearing anything. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Lido. Honestly, there's nothing you can do about those. Oh, actually, do we have like a new camera as well? It 
it really feels uh, easier to go into first person now yeah definitely you use your mouse wheel just once or twice and you're already in first person this is definitely a change Use your mouse wheel, Harry. <laughs> no worries. Well, this is like interesting. Wow, but it's really like boring. I love it. Hopefully there is nobody around here. Because we really need some uh, food. I mean... Some water. And that is a deer. Not on our menu though. No. Yeah, the water feels different. And the rain as well. Oh yes, Gordon. Actually, you're right. With the stags. That was a stag, right? Okay. Let's continue our way then. Yeah. Now that you're saying, uh, Gordon, now that you're saying it, definitely that was a stag. Because it had those antlers. Well, this is different here. I don't remember these trees here in the back. Or maybe I don't remember it. Anywho. Now the, the search for a turtle. Or maybe, who knows, maybe a crab. The search begins... Or a buck. Yeah.
Hmm. So far, no turtles. What's this? Could it be? Nah. Nope. I really thought. <laughs> What's this? This is a deer. Okay. Well, we don't need it. It's not on our menu and we're not starving yet, so... No point in going for it. Well, we're almost at the uh, south, so yeah, there we go. The grass looks different, it looks way greener, I, I mean, I really like it. We are flying very low at the moment during doing some aerobatics. I wonder if there's anything here. Oh, there is. The sound is changed. I th I think the Terra sound is definitely it it's changed. Oh, we have fishes. Who is screaming here? I honestly heard someone screaming. Weird. Don't know what that scream was. <laughs> Anywho. Yoink. I swear I heard that scream again.
weird. That that's that's like a bit weird. <laughs> okay. There we go. Hey Thomas, welcome to the stream. New AI? What the uh, what AI are you talking about? Because now Dude I I swear I heard it again. Oh yeah, this was the one. Okay, Thomas. Thank you for pointing it out. It, it sounded... I knew it. I knew it. It sounded exactly like Motra from Godzilla. Like exactly like Motra. I'm gonna herd it to Harry and then I don't know where it went there we go if that doesn't sound like Motra I don't know like really Oh yes, I've seen it. By the way, who here in chat uh, seen Godzilla? The new Godzilla X Kong, the new movie. Because that was an amazing movie. I waited, I waited for that movie for so long and it was so worth it. So worth it. Oh, I haven't seen uh, Godzilla minus one yet, Gordon. Maybe that's not a bad idea. Maybe I'll get it. A huge Godzilla fan yeah me too I watched the world uh, I mean the old movies when I was a kid when Godzilla was nothing but a, like a plastic figure like honestly that's how the oh my god <laughs> this one came out of nowhere
people, we were literally at the mercy of this raptor, so... This looks lovely. Hopefully he doesn't eat me. But it looks like I'm caressing it. Actually, you know what? Maybe I'll catch a fish for it. I'm going to follow him out of curiosity. Where are you going? Wow. He's fast. Oh my god, this Omni is fast. Oh wow, there's a pack of them. This is beautiful. There's like four large omnis and one smaller omni. This is beautiful. Also, it seems they they got something. And whatever they hunted that because that's like a big lung or a big stomach right there hmm. So there's like one, two, three, four, yeah, four adults and one little one. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, actually, there's two little ones. I love it when I see Omnipex. Oh my god, is Harry stuck? Oh, this is no. This is not good. Yeah, I'm just gonna grab some stem and see if I can uh, get him unstuck. Oh wait, actually Lidor is right.
that's that's very well thought, Lidor. Amazing. Oh wow, there's a Herrera. I wonder where the Herrera is and if we can actually pack him. And it seems like we have a small Sarah as well. Okay, now where is that Herrera? He's not here. Okay, next tree. These are like new trees. Honestly, I haven't seen those before. Also, I'm not seeing this Herrera at all. He's pretty camouflaged. Okay, I heard him. Somewhere. Oh, I see him. I think I see him. Yep. He's in this tree. I barely saw him. There he is. <laughs> Got him once. Got him the second time. Got him again. Hmm. Can't see him anymore though. Oh, there he is. Oh, that was close. He jumped over me basically. Yeah, I think I think we are pushing our luck. Yeah, he saw us. No point. No point, actually. Let's skedaddle. Okay, the clouds are blue. Something's wrong there. Okay, that's not natural. That's like a, a weird view. Wait, what? It just threw me... Nah. I think... I think not. 
I will definitely not wait 38 positions in queue because I got thrown out. So, uh, also I'm getting a bit hungry in real life. I think this is uh, actually a good moment to call it a night. But this is, uh, this was really amazing. Um, maybe we can do tomorrow uh, a stream as well. Either tomorrow, either on Thursday. Uh, I'm, I'm just uh, thinking about the fact that um, on the weekend I will not be able to stream because I will uh, have to go away from the city. So it is what it is. And yeah, I'm trying to make it up by streaming uh, today, maybe tomorrow, maybe Thursday as well. We'll see. But I'm really curious to continue our route. So from here, we're at south at the moment. From here, we will need to go to Swamp and check the new things at Swamp because I'm really curious. Like, Hopefully nothing intervenes, but I'm almost 100% sure tomorrow I will stream as well. So if any of you guys want to come uh, tomorrow as well on the stream, I would be very happy with it. And we can explore together and have a look at the, at the new things. So yeah, I can't wait. And then from a swamp, we can actually go to the Northeast Volcano and see that cave because I, I saw a bit of it from a video if I remember correctly some maybe yesterday or something like this or two days ago and it looked like quite spacious you can you could honestly uh, nest there if you wanted and there was also a water source so yeah looks like looked like a decent place so thank you very much everyone for joining the stream and for being here and i hope everyone stays uh, healthy and i hope you are happy and everything goes good in your life and the way that you want it to so yeah thank you again everyone for joining and see you tomorrow Bye-bye.